What's going on, everybody? Welcome to another episode of The Big Foodies, presented by Berkey Orthodontics, coming to you live, as always, from the Berkey Orthodontics Biggie's Kitchen Studios. And today, you guessed it. That's right. We're juicing. We're juicing, baby. Uh, Let's get a juice. Juice. Uh, juice. Not Give a juice, a juice cleanse. Uh, just talking your favorite juices. Yeah. A morning staple. Uh, yeah. Sometimes a throughout the day staple. Yeah. Um, I'm got. I, I'm a when you're sick staple. Yeah. Now I say, are you not? I'm a juice person still. I enjoy juice. Oh, dude, I will drink a yeah. juice anytime, anywhere. Juice is um, terribly misleading because it, you think it's made from fruit and it's going to be, oh, but it's mostly sugar yeah. and delicious. When you have to look, like some of these are going to say no sugar added, but that's it's still going to yeah. have. No sugar added, but we filled it with sucralose. Yeah. Well, that's, yeah, this is, yeah, there's no sugar <laughs> added. It says 100% juice, but it's still yeah. got, you know, yeah. I'm looking at it here. Yeah. Um, there's some, there's some sugar. So we tried to uh, do all the, I'd say the big flavors. Yep. Lots of juice in front of us. Got here. some different ones too in here. Lots so. of juice. Lots of juice, baby. Um, I'm going to say that we should start, though, with one that we have universally agreed we don't like this flavor. So I think we just get it out of the way. Okay. Grape the grapes. Juice. Now, the grape. I'm feeling I'm going to like grape juice. You think so? I feel like I've had grape juice in the past and it was okay. I'm sure you had grape juice as a kid. Yeah. I just, it's still never my favorite. Yeah. It's just communion. Communion. <laughs> it is what that. is that? Communion. Um, I remember even as a kid, I just wasn't a great flavored person. Let me ask you a question. You feel like it makes a difference if it's white grape or regular grape? I'm sure some do. I don't drink enough of it or haven't to. Yeah. That's like grape juice. Mm. I like that. You like that? Yeah. Look, I hate a great flavor, but that's fun. It reminds me of communion. Mm -hmm. Reminds me of being close well, to that the is, Lord. That is. And that's one thing you are. Yeah. So, <laughs> I don't know about you. you heathens, you've never been closer. It makes sense why you heathens don't like it. So. <laughs> I like it. Don't don't, don't put me in I that don't know. I just, it's not. <laughs> don't cast me aside. <laughs> it does remind me of communion because you're right. That is when you're. Yeah. Um, I don't know. It's just it's grape juice. I, no. I think I've had yeah. enough of it in my life. Speaking of communion, I I don't we need to get all religious up in here. But um, any of you guys raised Catholic? I yeah, it was yeah. So like I remember I went to go with my buddy to his Catholic church where they did communion, and I thought it was going to be grape juice. Uh -uh. I was dead ass wine, bro. Yeah, you can straight I drink wine. In the Catholic, yeah. Yeah. And I'm like, that is nasty. Did uh, did you did they do when you were growing up the same cup method? You know, yes, yeah, so they just wiped it. Yeah, yeah. That, so to me, you can't do that. Now. I can't believe we Not, lived in that can't time. Do that I mean, but uh, that's serious. I remember how I took communion was yeah. this like this universal cup. <laughs> It's just everyone's drinking. Like you take a sip of this goblet and then they wipe it around with the yeah. thing. And well, and just... some people would like take it and do it themselves. Yeah. And you just see this person who's like, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm religious. Mm -hmm. It's funny because it's wrong with us. It was not my religion at all, but I had no problem going up there <laughs> and drinking the wine. Chugging, chugging wine. Well, all I right. think the, where the disconnect is with most grape flavored like things. I think they use grapefruit because grapefruit juice to me is nasty. Oh, is that where you wanted to break it out? Yeah, we'll go grapefruit I, next uh, so that everything after this is better. Grapefruit juice? It's been a while since I've had it. Last time I remember not liking it. If it's not got vodka in it, it's not for me. Okay. Uh, when I was a kid, I hated it. I'll use the same cup for this it. one and then I'll get rid of it for uh, the next cup. I hated grapefruit, grapefruit juice. Yeah. Now, I love it. That, and not even like this is. Like you, this isn't even the ruby red, which is sweeter. This is just straight up old school. Your grandparents drank this. It tastes it. like orange juice has gone bad. Oh god, I love it. Like super sour OJ. I can't wait for berries. I hate it. <laughs> BB, you're gonna hate it. You're gonna hate it. That's exactly what it is. It's super sour. It's, it's bad so orange juice. Leave it with me, boys. Yeah, I love it. Keep it. Get that out now, of here. Now, I'll tell you this. You said you like it. You can mix it with vodka. I don't like it with vodka. I don't know what I it like is. I like it just as a straight up juice. I like I like vodka, um, club soda, or tonic with a splash of grapefruit. It almost just changes the color. And then throw me a lime in there. Yeah. So grapefruit juice, drink grapefruit juice is like, you know those little videos on Facebook that'll pop up where it's like, 
hey, if you drink a half a thing of grapefruit juice and some white vinegar, you can lose a whole bunch of weight. Yeah. I tried to do that, but that <laughs> shit was too nasty. I wasn't trying to keep doing I think that. that's, if I'm not mistaken, that's why people ate grapefruit in the morning was it was supposed to aid in weight loss. Yeah. Like you'd see these, you know, the 70s commercials of people eating half a grapefruit. For, now, <laughs> grapefruit, grapefruit, I can't eat. Uh-uh. Grapefruit juice? Give it to me all day. I, you, the first time I saw someone eating a grapefruit, I was like, why is this psychopath you, putting a spoon in an orange? Did you know that 50 Cent doesn't know the difference between a grape and a grapefruit? Really? Yeah. Anyway. <laughs> I was waiting. I thought there was going to be I thought, a... I thought it was, was a joke. Was, uh, was, I was waiting on a punchline. There was a stand-up bit about it. Uh oh. <laughs> I was, I was, I was like, like, I'm sorry. I, story I was waiting for it. I, was, I was waiting for a, a punchline. <laughs> Uh, Apple? Apple. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Back yeah, to something to get that taste out of my mouth. 365 days a year, there's apple juice in my fridge. Well, you have a child. Do you water it down for your kid? A little bit. Yeah. It's real sugary. Yeah. My wife works in the dental field, so the fact that he gets any sugar is a miracle. So that used to bother me, like, when my aunts and uncles would, like, water down juice for their kids. I'm like, dude, that's so stupid. Just let them eat the sugar. And no. Like, they're like, I, they're, I don't want them to grow up fat like you, Barry. <laughs> Well, I stand not- by. I, I will say this: I stand by the fact that my mom invented Trop Fifty mm. because <laughs> when we were kids, she cut orange juice down mm. in half. I mean, truly, she mm. would take it, and half of it would be water. My wife does it more for the cavities. It's it's less about the diet okay. as much as it is for just the amount of sugar going on your teeth because she works in. But there was one time I made my son some apple juice. Now, when I make it, spoiler alert. I give him more apple juice than the one. Put a little yeah. rum in it. <laughs> give him a little something extra. A little, a little he always something. drinks a lot of the juice that daddy That's pours so in. so sleepy. But one time I actually like tried some of it. Disgusting. But now if it's all you know, yeah, yeah, you know, yeah exactly. I get it. But no, I tried it and I was like, this is gross. I, uh, I had a boss when I worked with pizza who told me, and this has always stuck with me, you ever had a bad day, like a real bad day, Stop on your way home, get a thing of apple juice, and drink it. And just relax, and you'll feel a lot better. I don't know what that has, that has mentally stuck with me for 20 years. Yeah. And to this day, if I've had a really bad day, I'll stop, I'll get a Minute made apple juice, and I'll just sit for five minutes and drink it. And I'm like, oh, it's going to be better. <laughs> wow. <That's weird. laughs> okay. Life-changing stuff. Now, here's the thing about this apple juice. This apple juice sucks. <laughs> now, I love apple juice. You don't like Minute Maid's apple juice? Well, no, 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 no. I pay for the premium apple juice. Like the simply? white, the white, yeah, like simply. And oh, the, okay. And oh, the, bougie, bougie. No, yeah, yeah, yeah. The White House premium apple juice. That's where I will spend my money. And have you ever had like the, the good, like quality apple juice? I've had that. Now you're right. The simply, yeah, yeah that, I mean, that's really good. Like, Night and day. But I don't think there's anything wrong with a little Minute no, Maid in a no bottle. That's watered down apple juice. No, it's juice not. I, yes, that's apple juice. There's no flavor in there. I didn't know you're going on to. I didn't know you're going all the way to the uh, White House. Ooh, yeah, premium. premium. <laughs> I, I, I drink that premium. Bringing that's, this in your face. You know what I'm that's saying? Top shelf that's apple that's juice. water, bro. That's a piss. That's not. That's all that is. It's I just piss. picture you going to the grocery store and then having to get it out of the little rock and key box. <laughs> <laughs> like, oh, it's, it's, it's next to the, the razor premium. blades. Yeah. <laughs> He's here for the White House premium apple juice. They give me that. I don't know that I've ever like spin up for that. Normally, what I get. I will tell you, I do most of my shopping at the Walmart. Take a picture they have it there. And <laughs> I buy, I buy the uh, Great Value brand Honeycrisp apple juice. Ooh. Oh, now that sounds interesting. Yeah. Okay. I get the I get the one. It's about this size, so it's like two fifty or whatever. Yeah. And it's uh it's uh Honeycrisp apple juice, and it is okay. delicious. Now, if one once in your life, just. They get the premium, the simply, or the White House premium. It's a completely different experience. All right, okay. I'm doing All right, I'll do it. And, I'll do it. and uh, it's I'll like putting it. premium gas in your car. I'll do it. You okay. can tell the difference. Um, now let's get a little wild here. Yeah, let's do it. This is different. Um, I don't know who's responsible for buying this, but this one is a. Uh, it's your boy. You, I see you went a little off the uh, beaten path here. This it's is product of Mexico. Yeah, this is apricot nectar. Let's try it. Read it because this might be shake gently before opening. This one is. Wow. This is a... This is a process. Yeah. I don't see where mine says that, So, I, but you know what I'm going to do? Just give it a little... There you go. Turn apricot around. nectar. I definitely have not had this. This was unexpected. 
How's that look? Oh, that's thick. Mmm. Okay, okay. I've never had an apricot before. I don't, I was gonna say, I don't know. I have, but I just I've can't had, tell you the uh, last time. I think I've had dried apricot before. I think we've all had it. It's always mixed in to something. Yeah. This is, uh, it's thick looking. Mm hmm. Kind of an orange. It looks like a peach. Color. Well, it's like a peach, even has a pit of a peach. The taste bad. isn't bad. Yeah. The taste isn't bad at all. I'll tell you, though, I don't like it. It's a little thick. Yeah, it's a little, a little sludge it's thicker. It's like sucking it right off of an apricot. Like, it's like drinking it at, like, when we drink this pineapple juice. Like, drinking it out of a can. It reminds me of, um, like, if you were in the desert and you came across the fruit and you wanted to, you're just like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's, That's what's good. coming out. Yeah. You're right. But right the taste that. is good. Taste is fun. Yeah, it's a solid taste. Okay. You guys want to go with another one of those? One of yeah, those cans? Yeah. yeah. I'll tell you what these thicker ones will be perfect in. Maybe a little milkshake or some ice cream from the berry patch. A mango milkshake. A mango, good, yes. Oh, a mango milkshake. Even the apricot would that be. Good? Yeah. This kind of a little thicker. Mix that in with some berry patch. Vanilla ice cream. Oh, that would be perfect. The Berry Patch located right there off 220, the world's largest strawberry.com. Can't miss the world's largest strawberry no. as you drive by. If you're going to Myrtle Beach, you'll see it. You know what it is. Maybe uh, we're going down there in a few weeks, and so maybe we, we should are. take some of this with us to see if, see if they can put it in something. I'm sure they'll appreciate us showing up mm -hmm. going, can you uh, make, make this into ice cream? <laughs> <laughs> so to the Berry Patch, we say thank you as always to supporting the big foodies. This mango. Is, this little mango nectar. Now, I love mango, so this, even though it's... Definitely thicker. I'm looking forward to this. Mango, one of the best fruits. I love mango. I love mango flavor. Hard to cut. Very hard to cut. Now that's even thicker than the mm -hmm. apricot. That's almost too thick. Yeah. Don't like that. That need that needs to be cut. Yeah. Water that down. Yeah. Now is this this good is, flavor? Again, the flavor. Yeah, it's a good mango flavor. Good but that's flavor. A thick. I need a new cup after that one. Mm. Yeah, I'll, that I'll switch one. New cups. <laughs> cup change. Uh, for those of you who think we don't invest in the show, uh, I'd like to point out these fancy plastic cups we now have. We spent twenty-seven dollars on plates, and cups, cups, bowls, and cups. Yeah, all because of your comments. Like, mm -hmm. You guys are gross. <laughs> you're gross. You know, you're gross. Uh, all right. Where do you want to go next? Uh, what was this mango? Let's do the. Uh, you want to stick with you a can? You want to get out of no, the can? No, I said right? I'm in these cans yeah, now. I think we're guava. Do it. A fruit again? A fr you know, have you ever had guava, or have you just had guava flavored things? I like guava flavored things. So That's yeah. me too. I always say, "Oh, I like guava," but then I realize I've only ever <laughs> had guava flavored things. You saw it. I don't like that color. color. I don't like that color. I don't like that smell. Obtuse rubber goose green mousse guava juice. Ooh. That smells horrible. Is that what guava really smells like? I don't know that we should drink that. Upstake birthday cake, large fresh chocolate shake. I'm going to try it. That is not good. Did that expire? No. No, it didn't expire either. That's actually how that stuff <laughs> oh, tastes. Oh, that's, supposed, that's how it's supposed to be. Oh, thank God we got new cups. Screw that one, brethren. <laughs> No wonder guava's mixed with things because mm -hmm. it has a terrible flavor on its own. Mm -hmm. I that can't, is I can't horrible. do that cup. This doesn't expire for Ugh. six months. That is horrible. Ugh. It expired six years ago. Ugh. Is that really what guava tastes like? I guess. I don't, I've never, I've never had it. That's terrible. I've had guava juice before and it was great. I, don't know. I always thought guava juice was pink. Yes. Not fair. <laughs> Let's redeem here with peach. This is not expired yet. Actually. Okay. This is gonna be thick. This, yeah. I don't think a peach juice is. Oh, look at that. That is thick. It's thick. You are a thick boy. <laughs> <laughs> what would you call the show? Guava juice. Look at these thick boys drinking <laughs> juice. That should have been the name of the podcast. Thick boys. Thick boys. <laughs> <laughs> we really missed out on that one. Different. I don't know if I want to try it. Uh, 
you know what it is is we have an idea in our heads yeah. of what something tastes like because we've only tasted it with so much fake yeah. sugar, everything added. When you actually taste it, that is a horrible aftertaste. Yeah. I, I can't use this cup. I'm, I'm going through cup left and right, but that, I can't put That's anything terrible. else in there. You can dump that. Praise the Lord. We're out of that. We're out of that. Yeah. Jungle. All right. All right. Let's. Hey, can we try the palm juice? Because I've always wanted to, but I always thought it was too uh, rich for my blood. It's not bougie. Ooh. It, palm. People swear. I forgot that, that was there. People that. swear that it's good, like, health benefits. Pomegranates right? are an antioxidant powerhouse. Yeah. Yes. And the original super fruit. Drink up, up, and away. But then I always hear that, but then I, somebody always comes out, like, saying, whoa, whoa, whoa. It's just sugar. It's full of sugar. It's not good. All the sugar I'm gonna be outweighs the, the bad. Let's talk about this. Zero. I repeat, zero added sugars. Okay. This is 100% sugar from pomegranate. Okay. Pomegranate's a fruit with a lot of sugar, but yeah. this is all natural sugar. Okay. And there's a difference. There's a difference in added sugar versus Absolutely. Sugar. I don't trust anybody thing anybody says about food anymore. Because remember growing up that food pyramid we used to look at? Yeah. They used to say get eight to twelve servings of bread a day. Now like you're not supposed to eat bread. It's like, Nobody knows what's going it's on. It's like, man. Pl- like Pluto doesn't exist anymore. Like I'm on. still upset about Pluto. Yeah, I am too. I'll be honest, I fully expected like the bottle to be that color. I didn't realize no, yeah. the color of the juice. Yeah. Okay, let's talk about it. We need to. That's a sour end. Mm-hmm. I don't hate it. It mimics a juice that we haven't tried yet. Yeah, very much so. That gets you, but but, that, but much more sour. Much more sour. Super than sour. Bitter. And you're right. It's here. Yeah, that's sour. Huh. That's a little unexpected. I don't know that I... It's a hint of grape. I don't know that I like it, but I don't know that I don't like it. Yeah, that's so weird. And they have so many different types of this, too. I don't know, man. That's weird. That's super weird. That has a really odd taste. Yeah. I've always liked pomegranate being included in stuff, but yeah, yeah, I've never yeah. had straight up pomegranate at anything. Again, I think we have this flavor in our head mm-hmm. because of all the fake juice stuff. Mm-hmm. I did not expect it to be that sour. Mm-hmm. I definitely need a new cup after that. That's. that's yeah. I wonder if that would be good with vodka. Mm, it's quite possible. Antioxidant superpower. My tongue feels weird afterwards. Mm-hmm. Like a... <clears throat> it's almost like a bitter front with a sour finish. That's the best way to describe it is I feel weird now. Yeah. It's like when you see a movie that, like, affects you, like Girl with a Dragon <laughs> Tattoo. And you just think about it a lot yeah, later. It's like, oh, it's weird, man. It's, it's an odd thing. <laughs> well, I feel like we need to break up because we know that's going to be Eesh. bitter. Let's, uh, Maybe it's because our bodies aren't used to putting anything in it that's good for it. <laughs> so it's like, what are they doing? What is happening? Uh, let's break open the pineapple or the orange. It's like when you drink like some herbal tea and you immediately have diarrhea. You know what I mean? <laughs> that's what uh, that is. Like, oh, you don't want to be in me. Huh? Yeah. So the pineapple juice is interesting because it's, well, not really pineapple juice because they were out. Yes. So it's pineapple ring slices. Easy now. Don't don't keep it all for you. That's good. Pineapple juice is something that I don't think I would ever drink on its own. I personally oh, love pineapple juice. Really? Love it. Oh, it smells terrible. It, it always does. Like yeah. S- I love pineapple juice. Taste is good. I horrible. love pineapple juice on its own. I never think of it as drinking on its own. That's good. It, it, it smells terrible. I think most people buy pineapple juice as a mixer. I, yeah, that's the only time I And I love it. doing it just straight up on its own pineapple yeah. juice. If I went to a buffet, a breakfast buffet, and they had every juice that we've had here up, 
and I could pick one, I would probably initially get really? a pineapple. Okay. All right. A little pulpy, little okay. good pulpy. Um. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> it's fine. It's just the fact that I guess that how you did it. How long <laughs> did you, you and I have a side conversation and we don't notice him doing things yeah. like this. That you just literally just fingered a pineapple in front of us. A pineapple ring. Like oh, I, I, I'm curious now as to how much we miss. Well, <laughs> normally they tell us in the comments. <laughs> it was good, man. It just caught me off guard. We're having a great. conversation about buffets, and I look over, and you're like, "One ring for me, please." <laughs> he looked at me like it was like it was odd that we yeah. were <laughs> like it. wondering what he was doing. Like, well, you, guys, also, you guys ever done this? Well, also because your initial response was, "Nope." nope. I mean, it smelled. It nope. smelled like <laughs> smelled like ass, dude. It like, does. It yeah, smelled it smells, terrible. smells terrible. Oh yeah, bring out the big boy. Mm, this bad boy. Let me tell you. Definitely not have to worry about a UTI after this. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I are you fans? Um, I've never chosen to drink this without an ulterior motive. Okay, I drank I drank it for about two weeks consistently in college because I had a drug test coming up, and you heard, and I heard it flushes your system. And then I also heard it was good for your heart health. So for about a month, I would drink a small bottle of Ocean Spray Cranberry every morning to start my day. Hated it. It is my absolute favorite juice. For real. I'm shocked you didn't notice when you opened my fridge that there's a giant thing. It has cranberry it. juice in there. And I don't like it. I don't like cranberry juice drink. I like 100%. Mm -hmm. I like the bitter cranberry juice. And... I do think I'll drink like a cup like this about every other day because it is a lot of sugar. So I try to alternate and do that. I just love it. I do think it does have some health benefits. I don't know. I'd like to think it. Well, I think it does. I think it's it's good for heart health, yeah. antioxidants and things like that. See, a lot my, of vitamin C. My mom was somebody who, um, she's never going to see this. I'm just going to say she was selfish. Um, <laughs> was, yeah. Yeah, she doesn't She's not going to see this. Watch. She's not going to see um, no, but she, we drank what she and my dad liked. Like, we didn't go to the grocery store. Um, that's a lie. We got to pick out things we wanted. But we didn't get a lot of say-so in, like, juices and things. Mm -hmm. It was orange juice and cranberry juice. That was what was in the house. Mm. So I grew up with cranberry juice. Now, as an adult, I love it. I don't even really like vodka cranberries. I'll do mm -hmm. those. Mm -hmm. But just straight-up cranberry juice on its own, I love it. Mm. That and grapefruit juice were my two. I'm never going to sit down to enjoy a glass of cranberry. Really? It's going to be something that I'm drinking because I mm -hmm. need it. But we'll sit down and enjoy a glass of OJ. Yes. Like apple juice, I will get the expensive orange juice. Simply? Yes. I'm with you with that. Yeah. Simply orange juice is the Is that the best? I think it's the I best. I think it is, yeah. No um, pulp, no pulp. Uh, I can some go, pulp. I can go a little pulp, yeah. I like no pulp, but I can handle some pulp. I don't understand people that drink heavy pulp. I think y'all are psychos. It's when you start mixing it with the mango and stuff like that, that's where people come like, you just drink it. Well, right that's right. where you get into a juice cocktail that's not real juice to me yeah. either. Like, I, I love Sunny D as a kid, but that wasn't juice. No, it's not. So this is no pulp. 100%. I don't mind the pulp either. The pulp actually has more vitamin C if you bring in the pulp. So it's going to be a better for you drink if you have the pulp. My grandfather would take a glass of orange juice to, with him to bed every single night. And uh, he would leave it there and drink it in the morning. Like, warm. I know. I mean, what? he did live well into his 80s, but still that seemed very odd to me. Well, <laughs> All right. Be doing that. Now, I know this ran probably it's a long episode, a lot of juices. But, give me your top three juices. Orange, grape, cranberry. Wow. I did yeah. not expect that from him. Neither did I yeah. at all. Wow. Orange, grape, and cranberry. Pineapple, 
apple. Pomegranate? Okay. Wow, okay. I'll tell you, pomegranate, not my top three, but rank higher than I would have thought overall. Pomegranate is either in my top three or in my bottom two. <laughs> I, I, <laughs> don't, I don't know which one, so I'm going to say it with a question mark. Pineapple, apple, pomegranate? Um, my top three are going to be cranberry, definitely. Grapefruit, number two. I'm going to have to... I'd probably go orange juice at number three, but apple juice is right there, too. If it was a better apple juice, I'd say apple juice. He's still with the... He's just judging on the it's, apple it's, juice. It's man. not a good apple juice. I never knew he was so bougie with the juices. Yeah, I love juices. <laughs> well, please don't let that deter you from watching and supporting any more of our episodes. Remember when we had to force feed him fruit? <laughs> <laughs> This podcast has changed you. Yeah. <laughs> You're all bougie with this your juices. This has changed I'm you. Love, yeah, I'm a, I spend money on juices. <laughs> well, if there's a juice that we should try, maybe you want us to try pear juice. No. <laughs> Actually, if it comes you know in what? a... If it's, just, yeah. I'm going to say, this is the first time I'm comfortable saying you can leave your favorite juice in the comments, but I bet we just drank it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that, yeah. We drank a lot of juice. If it comes Odds in a can are. like this, we're probably not going to drink it. No, yeah, that's and true. Don't, and don't tell us, oh, you need to try pineapple orange guava. Yes, and we know juice okay. has a lot of sugar. Yes, there's <laughs> lots of that. There. I love the skinny people in the comments. But <laughs> you guys are our favorites. Uh, but thank you for liking and subscribing to our videos because we know you've done that. And I can assume you're all doing that now if you haven't. So thank you. Uh, supporting the podcast is always appreciated. Support the podcast by going to BigFoodiesPod.com and joining our patron program where you get bonus episodes, <laughs> extra content, <laughs> just for those of you that really, <laughs> really are the supporters of the Big Foodies. We are very appreciative of you. Dr. Berkey from Berkey, 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 Berkey Orthodontics. The Berry Patch is always for supporting the show and the juice. Thanks for existing. Matt, Big Or BB Shea. Oh, you talking about OJ Simpson? No, right. <laughs> you know what? Turn the, turn the mic we're, off. We're, we're the done. big, we're the big <laughs>